The goal of Katina X is to enable seamless collaboration across different organizations, use cases, and heterogeneous IT landscapes along the entire automotive value chain. To support this goal, solution providers are offering interoperable and data-sovereign solutions in the marketplaces. The choice of domain and kits to use for your solution will depend on the nature of the problem you are trying to solve. And, depending on the specific solution, one or more kits from different domains can be combined. Adopters can compare different solutions in the marketplace and select the best solution offering for their needs. Let's join the project team of this solution provider here, with Lisa, project lead, Yanis, product owner, and Max, developer, taking their first steps. Lisa has decided to become part of the Katina X community with their application called TraceX, which enables tracking and tracing of vehicles and components. As project lead, Lisa checks on the Katina X EV website which requirements her app has to fulfill for bringing it to the Katina X marketplace. From this point on, her product owner Yanis takes over. His task is to develop a business value and monetization strategy, both aligned with the Katina X ideas and values also published on Katina X. Once Yanis is done, he briefs Max, the team's dev lead, and points him to the Katina X development standards and kits which focus on interoperability, data sovereignty, and fast development. To ensure interoperability and data sovereignty within the Katina X data space, it is recommended to develop solutions using the artifacts from the toolbox provided by the kits. Why? Because it will enable your app to seamlessly integrate with other applications and services along the automotive value chain. Let's continue along our TraceX example. Max briefs the development team to have a look into the traceability, data chain, and connector kit. In the traceability kit, the developers can find the two Katina X semantic models, bill of material as planned or bill of material as build, and a data provisioning specification in order to provide digital twins. Furthermore, there is an API specification to implement notifications to communicate between other apps in a common way. After successfully developing their application TraceX, Max is ready to test it. During the development, the team can use one of our Helm charts to deploy a test environment including all relevant CX DataSpace components as well as predefined test cases and sample data in order to test their TraceX app. After Max has completed the development and test phase, the PO initiates the final steps to certify and submit their app. Yanis is relieved and looks forward to this step where the app will be reviewed and certified by a conformity assessment body to ensure it meets all Katina X requirements and standards. After receiving their certification, Yanis can submit their app to one of the Katina X marketplaces in the data space and offer it to adopters. TraceX will be one of our four applications on the Katina X data space in the beginning. It will cover all the functionalities of traceability as we have shown in our traceability case study. Adopters can choose which application suits their IT landscape best since all of them are interoperable through our kids. In this illustrative example, Yanis and Max successfully kickstarted their application through kits provided by Tractus X. With the help of the kits and resources available within the community, you can create innovative solutions that contribute to solving industry problems while ensuring interoperability and data sovereignty. Join us in building the future of the automotive industry together. Thank you for your interest in the Katina X community and project.